Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Oh my god, bet it cool. <laughs> anyway guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Tando Hadebe. If you're new here, welcome. Please like this video. Subscribe. Okay, make sure to subscribe right now and check out my old videos just to see what I've been doing on this channel. The Echo. Hi Mo. Huh? <laughs> anyway. Guys, um, for those who are new here, hi, okay, I welcome you guys. So like, if you don't know me and you've never seen me before, I'm Otando and I recently relocated to Cape Town. I've been here for two months now. Before that, I was in KZN and I did my community service there. So after concept, then I relocated this time without a job. So I recently begged my first permanent post okay my first job as a professional nurse i'm a professional nurse by the way and i also moved to my apartment literally two days ago i've already spent two nights here and i came to give you guys an apartment tour because you guys did say that you you want an apartment tour so nothing magic give the people what they want um yeah um, like I said, I've been here for um, two, actually, I haven't spent time in this apartment. I only slept the day I moved in, then the next day I had to go to work, and then today is my first full day in my apartment, basically. But um, there's things, okay, it's not like an empty, empty, empty apartment tour. For example, I've made my bed, so you guys are going to see my bed, you know? Um, yeah, it's not a fully empty it's not an empty, empty, empty apartment tour, but it's an empty apartment tour because I don't have any furniture. The only furniture I have is my bed and I've got clothes and that's it. So I have to start from scratch, okay? But we're excited for that. I cannot wait to furnish this place and yeah. So yeah, I think we can start now. Don't forget to like this video, guys. Please like it. Please do not skip the adverts, okay? That's how we make money as YouTubers, in case you didn't know. I know that a lot of people actually don't know um, how we get paid as YouTubers. So we get paid by Echo AdSense. So you need to watch those adverts. Don't press skip ad. Like, just watch the whole thing so that I can get paid. Thank you. <laughs> Let's start with the tour, guys. Enjoy. Drop the roof and let you smoke it. I got diamonds to it since he slides in both ears. Dice rolling on the Las Vegas trip tonight. Slip that on and we might miss the fight. Fuck a night, I keep the quality in my shorty bag. You know she won the mind when she tattooed that ass. I'm a lover boy. She got it. Okay, let's go. So I'm gonna show you guys from the door. So my apartment is in first floor, basically. And I'm at the door right now. Let me show you. Let me turn the camera around. So this is what the outside looks like at my door. It's a very beautiful area. Nice and quiet. And I'm going to close the door. Then I have to go up the stairs into my apartment. Um, here there's a, a switch, so you can either switch the light on here or up there. I'm gonna show you guys, but like for example, when I come from work, obviously I'm gonna switch it on here, but I'm gonna switch it off for now because we don't need it. So we're gonna go up. Please don't judge me, I've never done an apartment tour before, so do not judge. And then, this is how you enter to my apartment. This is the switch that I was telling you guys about. So this is for the door or for the light by the stairs. And then these lights are for the lights inside. So when you walk in, this is what you see. The first thing that you see, this um, huge space. Okay, I don't even know what I'm gonna put here. But um, obviously over time, I will know how to furnish my apartment as I go. Um, the previous tenant um, had 
um, paintings on the wall and pictures so she left the nails I don't have a problem with them for now but I will obviously remove them or ask the landlord to remove them when I do want to put my pictures and my paintings otherwise this does not bother me because it's literally a matter of removing it and filling those holes and then that's it paint it and that's it so I'm, I'm okay with it and maybe I'll put some of my paintings Gulama nails, I understand. So I don't have much of a problem with it. Anyway, um, and then we have uh, my plugs, Lana. We can plug anything. That is why I'm, I'm not sure what I'm going to put in this space here. I can fit a couch or I can just have a table or a desk. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. And then behind me, when you turn, um, you have this cupboard, which is nice. Let's talk about the color, okay? So, I remember seeing this um, apartment being advertised. It was advertised on Property24. And when I saw the color of the cupboard, I was like, oh, oh no, who wants that color, you know? Also, like, on the pictures, it looked really bad. Like, it was like, no, 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 I can't do that. But at the same time, I was desperate for a place to stay. Um, so I was like, let me go and see for myself, you know. And when I got here, I actually liked the color. It looks better than pictures. So, yeah. I get it, guys, you know, social media. I mean, most influencers and most YouTubers live in these apartments that have white covers, you know. So we all want that white or gray aesthetic. But... When I got here, I was like, this is perfect. I actually love it as it is. The color is different. I mean, the granite is, is it maroon? Almost reddish, I don't even know what that color is. But I still love it, it still looks nice. So I was like, uh -huh. you will not be getting aesthetic, but you'll be getting a nice apartment. So be grateful for that. So I actually love this color. It's just that with color, it's tricky now to furnish the place, but this won't be a problem this really won't be a problem anyway let me show you guys around yeah so you've got i'm um, plugging points here and then oh my god anyway um this cupboard i don't know is that the medicine cupboard i don't know what it's called but i don't know what i'm gonna keep there and then um there's a lot of scup of cupboard space here which i really really like i mean here there's like one two three four drawers okay oh, i put this the other day because we had sushi in Orlando anyway so yeah this is the space that we have in my apartment okay that is moving a bit uh -uh. anyway um and then here we've got the space for the washing machine i'm still confused as to how i'm supposed to position the washing machine here but we'll find a way so the landlord suggested that i put it here the space here so i think that's what i'm gonna do because if i put it somewhere here then is of it's not gonna be able to open so this is where my washing machine is gonna be at and then um the piping goes inside here and then it connects to the pipe here sink anyway um this is the rest of the kitchen guys those glasses um Ulanyo and i were drinking bubbles the other day when i moved in so like i said this some of the things in this apartment so it's not it's not an empty empty apartment anyway um then she said yeah this is where the trash or the bin goes i don't know what else i'm gonna put here but you see what i was talking about with the washing machine so the piping goes in there through here and then it goes in there and then um these are just the trash bags and then there's more space here and then that is the gas pipe and then the rest of the cupboard space so i have a gas stove here okay um i use gas to cook and then the stove here is just for the oven okay so i'll be using gas to cook and then this is just for the oven or if i ever then want to like cook 
a lot of dishes at the same time then i can use a stove but i'll be using gas okay i bought myself flowers the other day gents if there's a guy watching this this is a sign for you to buy your girl flowers our bees book once event event oh ladies if you've never received flowers this is a sign for you to buy yourself flowers and treat yourself the way you want to be treated okay i bought them at woolworths the other day when i moved in and then i also bought this um kitchen cloths and then there's also more um plug points here and then there's more space here let me show you so here i've got the um, the main switch the plugs and everything so this is way it is controlled in this cupboard okay so i've got that and then there's the electricity meter uh, when i came here it was 22 units i need to get electricity today and then the water meter the, the water here is prepaid so this is the water meter now now it's like 1000 and something liters so i need to buy water and electricity today and then up there there's more space okay And then if you come to my right or to the right then we have these shelves here which i don't know what i'm gonna put there but um it has to be nice because now it's on display everyone is gonna see it so it has to be nice and aesthetically pleasing and then um we've got more cupboard space here so i have to decide where my groceries are gonna go and where my crockery is gonna sit so yeah and then we've got it's not a wine rack but like a space for bottles okay <laughs> if i want to buy wine then it can go there and then if you come up here we've got another plug hey bro, why is that on anyway we've got another plugging point so this is where the fridge is supposed to be okay this space here let me move back a bit yeah so somewhere there i have to put my fridge so that i can plug it there okay and then that um footstep is not mine i think my landlord forgot it and then this is what the lights look like in this place it's kind of cute honestly guys it's really cute it's really cute so that is the kitchen basically this is what it looks like let me give you guys a full view of the kitchen This is what the kitchen looks like it's gorgeous i love this color and let me talk about this also i don't know what this is called let's just style at least but the tiles also love i was not sure about them but guys it looks nice in real life even on video right now it looks very nice so when i came here i was like okay you know what i'm taking this place i want this place in fact so this is beautiful and then when you turn, now there is this space here. Um, the previous tenant had her couch somewhere here, okay? So for me, it also makes sense to have it somewhere here. I don't know, I don't know, we'll see when it happens. And there's a huge sliding door slash balcony. Um, let me open it. So this is the sliding door slash window slash everything. And I think this is one thing that made me also go for this apartment because I was like, okay, then that means there's more lighting coming into the space. So it makes sense. I'm a content creator. Lighting is a big deal to me. So this is it. And this is my view from up here. I love it. It's, it's beautiful. It's beautiful and then there is this railing here there's this railing and this is basically what it looks like and and then um, there is this I don't know if it's a chest of drawers even though it's two drawers but this chest of drawers that um, 
comes with a place basically but if i don't want it and when i finally maybe get a tv stand but i don't think a tv stand would fit here but let's say i find something that i want to fit here then i can ask the landlord to take it but it comes with a place but if you want it out they take it out for you um for now i think i'm gonna use it because obviously you know more space more covered space basically and then here there's a plug point as well and then that switch is going to the bathroom and then there is this space here as well or this just wall here this wall here and that is a door to the bedroom and then the door to the bathroom let's go into the bathroom and this is what the bathroom looks like from the door i love it so much i love the tiles like it's it's beautiful and i love the space as well and then when you turn to my right there is this cupboard which i really want it okay i'm happy about this because i can fit all my toiletries here now um myself I don't mind because she also did me a favor. I would say you move it in um, early, you know, like I had to move in early because I needed to like move in as early as possible. I moved in before Usubulo move in. So now I'm going to go and go and go and go and go so yeah it's really not a big deal to me um because the cleaner also so she had to do it herself and then um this is what the basin looks like is this another team dish yeah, well, but I like it, it's cute. And then there's a stopper, here's a tab, and then we've got a mirror. But it's fine, it's clean and it takes less than five minutes to clean this book. And then there's this rag here for the toiletries, which I really, really, really appreciate. And then a towel rack. So, Lana, there is no blinds or whatever, but I'm not mad because who's gonna see me? You see? Like, who's gonna see me? No one is gonna see me. And then there's a toilet here. Very, very cute. Um, the brush. And then here's the shower. The shower is nice and spacious. It's been joy and jay. This is not so tall, but it's okay. I get to come to so I come to the room. Can you see? Anyway, um, yeah so this is what the shower looks like it's beautiful beautiful and then there's also that rack up there for the toiletries i don't like the shower head but um it's not a big deal it's not a big deal honestly and yeah that is it and then from the bathroom we go to the bedroom and then this is the bedroom okay when you walk in first thing you come across is this wardrobe and then there is this space here and then here we have the lights the switch for the lights okay i'm gonna switch it off for now and the bed okay i told you all that um it's not gonna be an empty empty apartment and then this side is also more space you know obviously i'm gonna have to fill the space up as time goes but um it's a one bedroom apartment there's really nothing to show in the bedroom okay we have one one two 
and three plugging points i have a plugging point here as well i turned on the heater last night because it's very cold and i don't have blankets as yet and then um let me show you guys the wardrobe so so this is what the wardrobe looks like from here it's very big and it has enough space okay i wanted to have enough cupboard space because i'm gonna be staying here for how long a very long time so you need a wardrobe a girl can never have enough cupboard space to be honest so let's open and this is what it looks like inside okay and then this side here is literally a duplicate of the side so it looks exactly the same i'm just not gonna open it because i have a lot of things in here like hey do not recommend and then up there we have just this open space um, i'm gonna be able to put my suitcases in there boxes anything in cool that i can put there i'm gonna put it up there blankets you know so i i love the cupboard space honestly it has more than enough if we're being honest if i complain here then and this side as well like i said one side literally this whole side is a duplicate of that other side so it would be perfect also if it was a sharing apartment you know like if it's two people living here then they'd be able to have i think enough cupboard space okay and this is the view that you get from my bedroom or from my bed that is the view so yeah guys that's basically it that is my apartment it's a one bedroom apartment and i think i'm happy about that <laughs> if i told you guys how much i'm paying here would be surprised especially if you're in joburg so rent is expensive in cape town y'all like if you are thinking of moving to cape town please if i get kind in the bio you'll be spending look at the lighting you'll be spending a lot of money on rent my apartment i could say it's affordable for the area that i'm in because um it's dependent on the area that you live in and um what is around the area are there any shops nearby do you have um easy access to transport uh is it safe okay safe areas are expensive obviously it's gonna be pricey so i am paying 6.5 for this apartment it's really not bad for durbanville because durbanville has expensive apartments i remember when i was looking for ap apartments here i think they were like 8,000, 7 8 000, 10 000, 12k and i was like there is no way i'm spending that much on an apartment every month get that eight thousand. I was like, no, no. Plus, as nurses, we get paid, but we don't get paid enough money to be renting 8K or 10K a month, you know? So when I saw this place, I was like, I am taking it. It's very affordable for Durbanville. It's very cheap for Durbanville. Um, so yeah, I also just wanted like a, a proper apartment, like have a kitchen, have a living area and have a separate bedro bedroom. I can't speak i'm hungry guys have a separate bedroom and 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 this is what i wanted i've got no complaints to be honest i've got no complaints so yeah yeah guys um i think that is it i'm gonna have to leave now and buy things so that i can furnish this place all right so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this apartment tour let me know what did you like okay what did you like the most and yeah i don't want to know what you didn't like because nothing was gonna happen anyway um yeah so i will see you guys on my next video which is gonna be a vlog thank you so much for the love that you guys have shown me on instagram and on my previous video i absolutely appreciate it okay you guys are the best anyway I'm a little